Hello, my name is Marco and today I'm going to teach you how to play solo number two from the book uh, The All-American Drummer by Charlie Wilcoxon. So first of all, we are in 2-4 and the cool thing of this solo is that it's not starting on the one, okay, but it's starting on the end of the second bit of the bar. So basically, and before that we just have rest, okay? And so it would be like one, two, ta-ta, one, two, ta-ta, Let's put a metronome on, just 60 BPM, nice and slow. So first bar. One. One. And then the next bar, we just have a one, eight and uh, 16 notes, okay? And the first uh, note of the bar is, as is accented. So let's play the bar without accent. And then add the accent. Next bar without accent would sound like this. And then add the accent. Next bar without accents. and then add the accents. And the cool thing here is that uh, we have one accent on the one and the other accent is on the E of the two. So to E, to E and the, okay? So let's play the bar with the accents. Next bar, um, we have a flam tap, which is this one. Okay, but yeah, let's play the whole bar without accent then, and without flam. And then we add the accents. And then we add the flam. Next bar without accents and without uh, flam. Accents. And finally, flams. In the next bar, we just have eight notes. All of them are flamed, and the first and the last one are accent, accented as well. Okay, so let's play the bar without accents and without flams. Now let's add the accents.
and finally the flares. Next bar without accents and without flams. Now let's add the accents. And finally the flams. In the next bar, we have two new things. Okay, so we have a track and we have our seven stroke roll. Um, so let's play just the first um, beat of the bar. So beat one of the bar without flam, without accent and without the track. So it's really simple, it's just Okay. Now let's add the drag. So two little notes uh, before the 16 notes. Okay. So we play the first note on the one, which is our eighth note, and then we play two little notes before two 16 notes. Okay. And again. And now let's add the accent. Again. And finally the flam. Then for the second beat of the bar, uh, on the beat we have a flam with an accent, and then we are going to play the seven stroke roll. Okay, so um, let's play the bar without sorry the second beat of the bar without the flam and the accent, but with the um, with the seven stroke roll. Okay. And again. So when you are playing the seven stroke roll, uh, think about a triplet, okay? A 16th note triplet. And if you are struggling with playing the seven stroke roll, just play the triplet and then double the notes, okay? So let's play uh, the second beat of the bar, okay? Without flam, without accent, and with the triplet instead uh, the seven stroke roll, okay? And now let's double uh, that triplet and we will get the seven stroke roll. Now let's add the accent and then the flam. And now we are going to play the whole bar and we are finishing on the one of the next pick so we can finally have the seven stroke roll completed. Okay, so let's do it.
And then in the next bar, we have the, the ending of the seven stroke roll as first note. And then we have another eight note with the flam and an accent. And then we have four 16 notes and the just the first one is accented and with the flam. So uh, if we play uh, that bar without accents and without flams, it would sound like this. So really nice and simple. Okay, and now let's add the accents and the flams. So first the accents and then the flam. And down the flams. Bear in mind that the first note that I'm playing is basically the last note of the seven stroke roll, okay? So let's play the two bars together now with the, uh, the accents, the flams, the drag, and the seven stroke roll. Again. And then we repeat the last bar, okay, and then we have a flam paradiso, so let's play the paradiso without accents and without flams. Now let's add the accents. And finally, the flams. Okay, so for the next bar, we have something really similar to the flam Q, but in this case, we have the first note accented as well. So a flam Q uh, would sound like this. And then obviously you have to complete the, 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 the flam Q, so. Okay, but now we are accenting the, even the first note. So it's going to sound like this. Okay. And then it repeats itself, but without flam at the beginning. Okay. Next bar, we have flam and two drags. Okay, so let's play the bar without flams, accent, or drag. And on the second beat of the bar, we have paradiso as well. Again. Now let's add the drags. then the accent and finally the flam again then for the next bar we have uh, again an accent and two drags but without the flam on the first note and we are starting with the left hand now okay so the bar without accents and without drags will sound like this now let's add the drag now let's add the accent In the next bar, once again, we have 8th note, 16th note with flams and accents. So let's play the bar without accents and without flams. And 
Now let's add the accents. And finally the flams. For the next bar we have a nine stroke roll and the track. So let's play the bar without the drag. Now let's add the accent. And finally the drag. And then it repeats itself, okay? So when you get there, you have to start again from the beginning, okay? And once you get, again, um, to this final bar, you don't have to play the bar with the one, you have to play this time the bar with the two, okay? Which is basically just the first part um, of, the, of the, the last bar. So let's play that bar with that little two on it, okay? So it's just a nine stroke roll with the accent um, on, the, on the second beat, okay? And once again, last time. And now let's play the whole uh, solo, okay, with the repetitions and um, yeah, nice, slowly at uh, 60 BPM. Thank you for your attention and I'll see you at the next lesson.